This presentation is about my great uncle, Edward Ronald Balsfield, who trained to be a pilot in World War II, but sadly died. Who was he? Edward Ronald Balsfield, known as Ronald, was born on the 6th of February 1912 in Liverpool. Ronald got his wings on the 19th of August 1939 and was a pilot in the RAF. Time in the RAF. Ronald completed his operational training with 14 OTU in June 1941 and moved to the Hanley Page Hampton Twin Engine Bomber and transferred to 50 Squadron at RAF Lindholm. This is a photo of Ronald in 14 OTU in February 1941. You can tell it's February because they are wearing gloves and there is snow on the ground. This is a video about the Hanley Page Hampton Bobber. A fitting accompaniment to Sir Kingsley's appeal is the launching by Viscountess Hampton of the bomber, Hampton. I name you Hampton. is a day and night bomber, and her speed compares very favorably with that of the bombers now in service. Her two engines aggregate nearly 2,000 horsepower, and her fighting equipment is totally enclosed. The pilot, too, has an enclosed cockpit with an unrestricted field of view. On the 19th of July 1941, the squadron moved to RAS station Swinderby. 50 Squadron left Lynn home for Swinderby in formation shortly after which Ronald's bomber crashed, killing everyone on board. The Hampton aircraft was generally pleasant to fly, however, one problem thought to be responsible for many deaths was a lack of control from the small twin fins at the back. If the aircraft was allowed to side slip, immediate action to correct the slip was needed. Otherwise, the aircraft stalled, dropped a wing, turned upside down and crashed. This is what happened to his bomber. A legacy. Even though Ronald died, he was still awarded his war medal, which was given to his father to pass down to future generations. My granddad is named after him. This is a letter from the government about Ronald's death. I hope you enjoyed my presentation.